What if you loved you? Makeup wouldn't make you look different. Your resources wouldn't be used to objectify yourself. What if you loved you? Your thoughts wouldn't care what others think. Your mind wouldn't be occupied in some other time. What if you loved you? You wouldn't use your time to be used by others. You wouldn't expend your energy until you're completely spent. What if you loved you? Your actions wouldn't be to gain a reaction. Your activities wouldn't be an act of abandon. What if you loved you? You wouldn't use your voice to hold others captive to lies. You wouldn't hold your tongue when transgressions occur. What if you loved you? You wouldn't bypass your heart and choose to be enslaved by your mind. You wouldn't avoid solitude, stillness, or silence. You see, self-love isn't shallow acts for validation of parts of you that aren't even you. Though you must revere the earth suit, self-love isn't the support or acceptance of a person or group gained through manipulation. Self-love isn't the possession of things or people. Self-love isn't escapism. Self-love is radical acceptance of self in all its facets and integrating spirit into those parts to become a completely embodied, liberated being. Intention is everything. Self-love exists as a constant, inspired expression of love versus a desire of power to serve only the self. Self-love is a constant state of being. It's evident and rare. You'll know it when you see it because you'll be riveted by it if you've got it. Snub it if you don't. Love is not reliant on anything outside of you. So if you were the last one to exist, the only one in existence, love would still exist.